This just came out of nowhere. You know. Hey, get me a test one. I'm going to drag the Star Squadron official review of Trash. That's right, we're going to start the campaign. Yay. Yay. Now, do you want to talk with everyone? Like, As you know, well, no, I'm a Star fan. I also know I will be the Ghost Squadron games. And also, no, I'm a Star fan. Well, but you Jerry Pong, who else? So, if I get a new Star game from year and 40, it's happy to say it's very, very worrying. Again, what do I mean by that? Well, you'll find out. There we go. So, joined by the engine, engine, and trailer. Oh, one more thing. Um, no, no way in general, I don't watch certain footage, but I said I'm going to do that certain footage, I'm going to show my name yet. So, this is probably the last time I'm going to do two hours and kind of like this with footage. Again, what do I mean by that? Well, you'll find out in there. So, enjoy the show. See ya. All right, um, all right, um. As you can tell from my intro, I you can tell my intro about this trailer. Why? You'll find out. Let's get started, shall we? By the way, I'll probably talk about Richard Avigano and Copyright Bullshit. See the X-Wing? Interesting. God, God, you were amazing, though. God, you were awesome. I did that. Pilots. You are the Empire's strength. We do not accept defeat. Hmm. Remember why we fly. Okay. For the new Republic. New Republic. Okay, so time of my uh, we're still doing the first order versus the um versus the um the new republic. So th so this is not basically uh, episode four five six. Makes sense. I'm the perfect shot. Squadron. The galaxy's finest. Ooh. This doesn't cool though, I agree with that. Ooh! Star Wars Squadrons. Oh my god. Yeah. Why is October 2nd, 2020? That's that quick? Huh. Interesting. Okay. Okay. Java Trail, it seems to me in general, I think this game is gonna kinda of like a low scoring game. Which I like Bob for we really, really need a low scoring game for years. Like, what took so long? Why can we get a low scoring game after like like months ago? That the got the good news. Now, do I think EA I think we go fuck it up and do I think do I didn't put market design on this bullshit? Uh, no, EA, they'll probably will do that, because let's face it, it's EA. EA are one of my corporate assholes. So, forgive me, forgive me if, if I'm not really skeptical at the first. Not granted, in general, see, apparently this game will be a first person 585 multiplayer dogfight on Train Squadron. So, yeah, I'm guessing that this game will probably be a multiplayer game instead of a single player game, in fact. Yeah, and we finally get the story now with the story center. Quote, a faithful campaign set near the conclusion of the Civil War, war, war learn what it means to be a pirate and first our single player story. New public fight for freedom, the Empire demands order, we need you to join the Galaxy's first Star Squadron in October 7th, 2020. Yeah, yeah it's coming October 7th, 2020. And game will be revealed June 18th, 4 p.m. Pacific. Which, okay, that's the game. The game we all get single player. That's what I'm happy about. Because I'm sorry we get single player, because I didn't have it before. The problem with EA started out with them is that we bear single player but for years. Do I single player go Jack Four? It's good, in fact. Because aside from Jack Four or Jerry, EA gave a giant shit with the Star Wars. They have done nothing with the Star Wars for, for years. Until I think now and then we're finally getting a new game finally. Well, kind of score. We are getting a new game, Star Squadron, which is pretty cool. But aside from Jack that's about it. Like I said, like, I don't trust EA. EA book my way too many times, so forgive me if, if I'm very really skeptical. That being said, though, 
I will give them at least this. This these guys do may do awesome to come maybe you with the the um die die engine. Flashbang engine over say. So we're gonna need a flashbang engine actually for this um for this game it makes sense. Now like I said, I am having working a solo scoring game, but for getting I'm not skeptical, right? Because before I did this shut down Lucas on and John and that bullshit and that perfect app grade, we, we we were getting good games from Lucas We got like X-Wing, Tide Fighter, X-Men Lions, like right? what's going on from there? We, like there's so many games we have been on the Ugazons. And it breaks my mind how many lots of for bullshit. Because we had Battlefront, Battlefront 2, Nigel Poet, Nigel Book 2, Episode 3, Jay Knight, Jay Kami, Jay Knight, Jay Alkin, Punk Commander. Like there's so many stories that I can't my head that we'll be all day. So, like, we gonna give me everything I ever want as a Star Wars fan. Expanding, you know, as a Star Wars, we just all agree game too. So, yeah, forgive me, forgive me that I'm skeptical, but yeah, that bullshit, I just can't trust them because they've broken to way too many times. That being said, if this game is great and this game is single player with the agent and single player and multiplayer, then I am hoping, hoping, praying that God, EA does not fuck this game up, no muggers design, no bullshit, with this game a single player action, like, low scoring game. Because low scoring was a great friend that I made, that friend was awesome and badass, it gave me hope. That being said, though, this game is coming out to October, so it's coming for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC as well. So that's kind of really close to the uh, to well uh, the PS5 launch date, which is actually kind of weird. You know, which is going to have to need to have another console version, but I get it. Really do you want to make that the best of the console best you can with the new con? Well, PS1 versus. But hey, hey, we just got something. You know, um, instead of nothing, I'm just going to do is. Now, since it's coming out October 2nd, um, what does it mean? I don't know. Like I said, I, I, I don't know what's going to happen with this game. I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm very sure to find out. And will I play this game? I probably will play this game for curiosity, but will I buy it? Uh, no. I'm probably going to smile and just rent it. Because I think renting might be the better option. Because let's say, I can't trust you in the bullshit. So forgive me, so forgive me if I'm not really skeptical. But hey, we we you know we find God at, at the end of Star Wars game at the God of the Wars gonna release, yay. But what it am I we don't know. But say what did it waste in the cool thing, but any who wanna talk about I think that's probably it. Oh I know. That's why we have to start squadron and fix a little video trail, um Pre on Cotton Mercy, you better as uh, the trail, do I get to it? Also, how do you avoid a new World Squadron game? Well, cast or whatever, now we're also going to need more uh, experience success to World Squadron. Um, pre on Carnival, um, also work on Facebook, on Twitter, um, pre on Scarlet Channel, for our Christmas stars, click the bell icon, yeah, I was in a long story. If you like me, you can, I'm talking longer, start with, woo, see ya, bye, start with, EA, don't fuck this up, please. I'll tell you, see ya, my own story, see ya, bye, start with.